Hey guys, Connor here from the Connor Gaming YouTube channel. Welcome back to Terraria. Now, as you may see, um, things are a little bit different. Well, I restarted the LP world because, well, I didn't really have a good spawn last time. And, well, I've kind of done some work off camera to do all the boring stuff. I died. And I don't really want to go back into the underground tundra. I died right there. This is all the, like, those blocks where if you stand on them, you, they, well, if you jump on them from a high height, they break. It's one of those blocks. And, well, I made this, like, area, and I jumped, and I didn't realize that it would be high enough to break a bunch of blocks, and it broke basically all the way down to here and that's where I died three minutes ago and that's where I thought it'd be good to start the episode because well I haven't recorded in a long time sorry about that I was off on a trip last week all oh, last week eh. it was pretty good basically just went to a theme park I'm not gonna say the name like a copyright claim or something I don't know, but we went to a amusement park, basically, you know, we had fun. And also, during that, I found out that in Harry Potter, I would be in the Ravenclaw house. I just thought that would be interesting. I need some slime. Yeah, there's a cave worth exploring. Now, I'm going to go explore a cave. Because we haven't done that all of this series. Like, at all. Like, maybe once, but... Maybe in the first episode, but I honestly don't remember and... Oh. Well, that's boring. All I have is Daybloom seeds. Daybloom seeds are boring. For all those terraria players out there might agree with me. Because they don't really give you anything interesting. Well, there's a cave on the other side, but I don't really have any resources to build a bridge. Or, no, why did that happen? I wasn't even holding down. This always happens. It always happens. You know, so I changed my username. I changed my username to being Connor A. Oh. Yeah, look, my username's Connor A now. I probably should change that. That's weird. Wait, is that Mario Odyssey? You know, I'm gonna change this real quick. This it won't take that long. I don't know what to change it to. Eh, why not? You know, probably the blue guy. Look at him. Yeah. Wait. Well, also, this isn't the right color. <laughs> I <laughs> barely like that color. Yeah. There. I didn't save. I hate it when it does that. Okay. So, that's all I wanted to do. <laughs> I didn't even want to do that. I just did it because I thought it was convenient. A convenient time to do it. But, eh. Well, today we're... Well, for the start of the episode, I'm going to try to find a strange plant so I can get the last NPC I had last last episode um this time because well i need all my npcs in order to actually well be back to the original state i had my playthrough in also i lost all my money in that cave you know we're gonna try to go back in that cave and actually get out 
<laughs> Maybe. I mean, it's not guaranteed. Like, honestly. Nothing's guaranteed. When it's me, nothing ever is guaranteed. All that stuff's garbage, too. Why? Wonder how that happens. Heh, <laughs> get that done. <laughs> Probably saw that I could do it, but tried it to do it himself, but failed. Now we're gonna go back to the underground tundra. Real quick, just, just a, like, revisit for a few minutes, hours maybe, trying to figure out that, how to get my stuff back. I probably am just gonna have to dig up. Now where is the underground tundra that I went in? I don't remember. I jumped here. Actually, I can look at the mini map. I can also see where I'm going in the mini map. Pretty much. Oh man, I miss rocket boots. There we go. That's the underground tundra I went in. Right there. I need torches. Rope. That won't help me. Rope is not helpful. Silver is kind of helpful, but not that helpful. I need torches. Torches. This game does not understand what I need. I need torches and that's it. I can get very serious serious when I'm literally talking to a game that literally doesn't even know what I want. Still no torches. Still no torches. Like, all I want, torches. That's all I want. I can grab torches. Of course, I knew that the entire time. I knew that the entire time. I knew that the entire time. <sighs> you know, I'm pretty good at voicing things. Pretty good, but not when it comes to like, when it comes to evil characters, I'm pretty good at voicing them because, well, my, I have a very serious voice. I have a voice that sounds pretty serious. <laughs> pretty groggy. <laughs> no, no! Demon Eye, go away! I don't care if you have black eye. I don't care if you're a black de pu uh, iris demon eye. Die! This game is kind of scary for me. Because, you know, poor old 10 year old like me just doesn't understand that I can literally just run away and be fine. Or not, because the stupid demon I likes to hang around near me and literally try to kill me. Even though I can technically kill it with like 20 hits. Dead. As simple as that. What was I afraid of? I don't remember. Oh my god, what happened to the poor bunny? Oh, it is me. It is only me that's standing between you and Cthu the eye of Cthulhu. He said Cthulhu, so I have to say, I say the eye of Cthulhu because I'm not weird. I might be. Slight, tiny bit weird. Where happened my bow? Oh yeah. I lost it. In the fiery depths of heck. 
Oh yeah, I lost it. The fiery depths of heck. Let's craft all the copper I can. Let's craft all the silver I can. Oh. <laughs> There's like a simple stack of 19 there too. Oh, that's hilarious. Go cool one. Also, I still need that strange plant because I have standards and I need gold so I can basically have a second inventory. Ah! All my silver. Whoa. This is why I'm afraid of this game. Yes, you heard that right. I'm afraid of this game. I don't care if it's a quick copper short sword. I don't even care if it's freaking agile. Even though that's kind of one of the best modifiers. Maybe. I don't even care if it's legendary. I just don't like copper short swords. At all. Copper long broad swords are my swords. Are my copper swords. Also, would you consider it cheating if I went to another world and grabbed some simple supplies? Would people consider that cheating? Hmm? I don't know what people consider cheating nowadays. Because I was born in a simple time where, where cheating didn't exist. 2009, where Minecraft was just born. Literally, it was in, it's still in its earliest stages, like the earliest beta. I'm not joking, Minecraft was still in the earliest beta when I was born, like November 30th, 2009. Did I need to say that? Yeah. I don't know. Like, it's not even personal information. Like, in for me, I don't know what personal information is that much, though. So, I'm the stupid mate here. And yes, I say mate because, well, I think I'm like, I don't know, 20% British or something? Like, I'm partial British, I know that, because I have a a slight British accent. Like, good I might. <laughs> like, I, do, do I? I don't know. I don't know the difference between British or Australian. Which is pretty weird, to be honest. Like, for the longest time, I was thinking whenever I would do a British when I was trying to do a British accent, I thought I was doing an Australian accent. Can you believe that? Like, that, Jack, what's he doing? Yeah, my little brother's playing on his tablet. Jack, it's enough. Uh, I need supplies. You know, what should I make the title of this episode? I restarted the world? A third time? Nah. A second new beginning? Nah. Uh, one of those two. You know what? I'll probably just do the second new beginning. The new new beginning. Yeah. So, guys, that's gonna end off this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. <laughs>
Eh, sorry if it's shorter than all my other videos. I didn't really have any ideas. Well... Bye.